welcome back to my channel i have a very important video to show you today um sometimes some of my subscribers told me to make a video about uh, you know this uh, too much of uh, rumors about when you travel to village and give some people in the village money the money will turn back and make you become poor when you come back to the city the money you uh, due to your kindness you shared money to the village people and they use it against you they use it and do something to do for you do something bad to you so that you will become poor yes such thing happened most especially when you travel for christmas celebration or when you travel for any festival period some people now they wish of them to give you cash they prefer to buy things and give you because people are not evil they use those money, go to shrine and go to the wrong place to reach on to. So today I'm going to show you the solution so that you can travel to your village without any fear. Dash people money, yeah. They, there is adage. Your goodness, your kindness will not kill you. Your kindness, if you give if you are a giver, it will not harm you. God will rather bless you more and more. So, but there is a lot of evil people, enemies of progress, those people that hate progress, that is envying you. So, and today I'm going to show you the solution, what you are going to do to be free. And and uh, whenever any person plan evil, when person you are blessed monetarily and is not paying you back, the thing will go back to him and punish him more and more because we are doing good. And the person who do good shall receive good. So, let's for example, you went to the village, you see old people that you're supposed to assist, go ahead, give them money. So, but before you start going out to give people money, I'm going to show you what you are going to do. So, now, what you are going to do is to get your salt and red oil. Then the next thing... Next thing, look for St. Leave. Look at St. Leave or Basse Leave. You get it from the village. You have, it's very popular in the village. Then you have it in your hand. So this is salt. This is red oil. So what are these things you presented? Everybody in the village where you come from, they use red oil mostly than vegetable oil they use this scent leaf acid leaf to prepare pepper soup of their bush meat and they use salt everybody use salt so for that reason salt is meant for good it's open door is prosperity is wealth so use the salt how do you do that use the scent leaf cut some of it and squeeze it this way when you squeeze it this way when you squeeze it this way you open your red oil you open the red oil and take little of it like this touch the salt and put it inside your mouth like this what this signify that whoever that eats salt and eat red oil and eat scent leaf in the village and we are blessing them and anything we use that money to go and do the thing will bounce back to him or her and you will be free it's like exodus fourteen fourteen. the god shall fight your battle and you will have your peace you touch the salt with oil then put it in your mouth and do it as well. Then use it again, touch it and use anoint yourself. And said, Ebre mebulam, Ebre mebulam, Ebre mebulam, Ebre mebulam four times. After you say this four times, Ebre mebulam means in English, My kindness shall not kill me. My kindness shall not kill me. My kindness shall not kill me. So after this thing, go ahead and be kind. Give people money. Give whoever, whoever calls himself a lynch or wizard or evil person in the village. Give him money to eat. 
and you'll be free. Rather, you'll prosper more and more. Thank you for watching the video. Please share it to your friends. You know, the social media so that they will be free to be kind for people in the village. They, some people are good, while some people are bad. Don't abuse because of these things that are happening and refuse to help people. Thank you and God bless you. See you on my next video. Bye.